Okay, who's excited to react to Child's Play? I am. Um, we are going to take a look at this trailer from the 2019 version of Tri Child's Play. Now, there is an 80s version of this movie, um, and it's going to be interesting to see what they do with this trailer, because the original was a very straightforward, kind of quirky comedy, but also horror movie. Um, I remember really liking it when I saw it. I, it's been probably 10 years since I since I saw it, but um, I want to see what they do with this, bringing it into 2018. They're going to have to make it scarier, and they're going to have to give it more of a plot, because the first one didn't have a whole lot of a plot. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. He's older. Is this supposed to be a sequel? All of your Kaslan products and smart home No, it's okay. Introducing your new best friend. It's going to be an app this time? Not a doll? Or it's going to be a robot? Oh, that could be interesting. Because you know I don't trust Amazon Alexa. I thought it was going to do a robot angle. Did something. Oh, look at his little arm. If you know something, you better tell me. Something's wrong with Chucky. Buddy can connect to and control all of her family. Chucky is a toy. He could be anywhere. Oh, they're going to go the Stranger Things angle. Okay, well, that was a very strong trailer. Very strong. And that's a creepy looking doll. Creepy looking doll. Um, great. Oh, wait a minute. Mark Hamill's going to get a voice? That was interesting. Um, kind of what I expected. They're making it a lot darker. They're going to update it for modern times. It's so have to show interesting you that sites. they are not doing this in the 80s because 80s movies are so popular right now. And like the, the Stranger Things vibe that they have going on would have worked really well. But this new like tech version of Chucky is interesting as well. So they put it on an app and that makes a lot more sense than the original movie where the doll um, die. There's like a murderer, and he dies in a store next to a doll, and the spirit of the murderer goes into the doll. Okay, so that's just totally like wacko crazy, um, and it's supposed to be like over the top fun. This is darker because a robot, an app that goes uh, that goes insane on you and tries to kill your family, is a little bit more plausible uh, with with Amazon Alexas in her house and with. Um, you know, Google robots or OK Google, and um, everybody has robots in their house now. And this is just kind of a little bit past logical step, but it's not a totally wild, crazy, like insane jump um, that's supposed to be silly. This is more realistic. So I think this is going to be interesting to watch. My only concern is that Andy seems way too be way too old to be playing with. A doll, um, but maybe if they go the robot angle, that could work. I think they aged Andy up because in the original movie he was maybe four years old, and he's like eight or nine in this one. Um, in the, uh, I think maybe that they aged him up in order to be more of a Stranger Things angle, where they have like the kids central to the story, and they're trying to solve a mystery and they're trying to to do things together. So that could be really fun um, because that's kind of the popular thing with horror movies right now is a group of kids going off on an adventure. Um, so what do you guys think? Are you excited to see the movie? Are you excited for Mark Hamill to voice Chucky? Um, and 
do you think this is something you'll watch? All right, let me know what else you'd like me to react to in the comments down below. I'm going to be trying to do more of these videos with the uh, stuff on the screen for you guys to see. The problem with that is anything other than a trailer or an ad gets blocked immediately. So I did try to, I did make Beyonce videos where you guys could see it on the screen. As soon as I uploaded it, YouTube cut it off um, because it isn't my material and I'm not, I, I am doing it legally because I'm offering commentary. Unfortunately, YouTube doesn't recognize fair, uh, fair use. Uh, but I'm going to keep trying my best to do it. All right, you guys, leave something in the comments down below. Hit that like button and the subscribe button, and I will see you in the next video.